Hello and welcome back to the Royal Daily Tea. So I have some breaking news. Prince Charles becomes the latest royal to test positive for COVID-19. Clarence House has confirmed today that the Prince of Wales has contracted coronavirus for the second time. Writing on Twitter, it said, This morning, the Prince of Wales has tested positive for COVID-19 and is now self-isolating. His Royal Highness is deeply disappointed not to be able to attend today's events in Winchester and will look to reschedule his visit as soon as possible. The prince recently saw his 95-year-old mother, Her Majesty the Queen, earlier this week. Although Buckingham Palace has confirmed she has no symptoms, they have refused to confirm or deny if she is positive or negative. The heir to the throne was one of the first major figures to test positive for COVID-19 at the start of the pandemic in the spring of 2020, a few weeks before Prime Minister Boris Johnson also contracted the virus. At the time, Charles was at Burke Hall home in Scotland, where he self-isolated with the Duchess of Cornwall, who did not test positive. The news comes after it was announced yesterday by the Danish court that Queen Marguerite, who is celebrating her golden jubilee this year to mark 50 years since her accession, has also tested positive for COVID. She was forced to cancel a planned holiday to Norway, where she was to spend time with King Harold and Queen Sonia. Earlier this week, King Felipe VI of Spain was also revealed to have the virus. His wife, Queen Leticia, has tested negative and is still undertaking official duties, as is the couple's youngest daughter, Infanta Sophia. So this marks three major royals coming down with the COVID-19 virus this week. We send our best wishes to them for a speedy recovery. But what are your thoughts, guys, on three royals getting COVID this week? Leave your comments, guys, down below.